Hey y'all, it's Carol Sue. Welcome back to Carol Sue Southern Designs. Today I have a big Timu haul for perfumes. Um, I had some members or some subscribers uh, request this a while back, so I finally was able to get enough together to have a pretty good size um, haul. Let me see. I have. Um, I went ahead and screenshotted all the ones for I'll be able to help y'all with um, what they smell like because we all have different scents or different sense of smells and stuff. Um, so I did copy each one of them. It took a few hauls to get this many to have enough. So I'm gonna try to go through and have them in order. That we have to flip, 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 flip through my pictures, but. Um, it's a pretty good size one. Uh, I have in the title how many there is. I don't know. Uh, so, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get these all laid out for y'all. I have to hear the bag and all that stuff. And, uh, yeah, so stay tuned. Come on, y'all. Okay, I'm back. Uh, I got 16 different fragrances here. Uh, I have some empty boxes. My grandson, uh, my oldest grandson, Jason, he loves sweet smelling fragrances, perfumes, clones, whatever you want to call it. Uh, he uses the, um, the, for him or her, it doesn't matter. So he's, he has stolen a lot of these out of my bag. And like I said, I've been collecting these since Christmas. Uh, so what is that? Almost three months now to be able to get enough. And I think I have 16 different fragrances. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna start and go down how uh, I have the pictures of them. Some I don't know the dupes to them, but some have uh, are dupes, and they're like really big dupes. So I've already seen that as soon as I got them, they were discontinued. So if I could find what is comparable to it, I will link it below. But like I said, um, like I have dupe, dupes for uh, YSL, uh, Sauvage by Dior, Versace, uh, and there's another brand I'm not really sure uh, but as soon as I got those they were discontinued and I have the Sauvage by Dior uh, because we're big Johnny Depp fans here in Kentucky you know we love him um, so I bought that to um, I bought the real Sauvage by Dior uh, to support him and uh, so yeah it smells just like it but so let's, let's, get, let's get started uh, I can only tell you what I feel that they smell like. Um, it's up to you, but the prices are so great that it's not going to hurt uh, trying them out. You know what I mean? So the first one is Jasmine. It doesn't give you a list of you know, it's Jasmine, so we all know what Jasmine smells like. Um, this, rain, rain. It was $1.88, and this is a solid stick roll-on. It says it, um, oh, that's so sweet. It says Charming Fragrance Solid Balm. And at the bottom it says, Don't Forget I Love You. Can you see it? That's sweet. It is sweet. You just want to hear it every once in a while. Okay, and this is, I am not going to try saying half of these names because of my Kentucky accent. It, it just ain't happening. But this is Lex Co Lex Coco. Co Co Coco, but it's jasmine tea and believe me i have um jasmine incense not incense uh essential oils and i have the real jasmine oil and it smells just like it but it is a soft now i'm not gonna put all this on because i'll be going around smelling like a french you know what but i love this one and it's jasmine i love the smell of jasmine i don't have jasmine in my yard I wish I did, but I don't. Uh, but yeah, this is Jasmine, and it doesn't give uh, how many ounces or anything anywhere on it. So, but it is a little one, so you could just throw it in your purse. And uh, but it was a dollar eighty-eight. Uh, let's see. Oh Lord, I didn't lost my pictures. Let's try this again over there. There, as long as I don't touch it. Okay, this is another solid uh, tent arc. And this one is very berry, and it's by Tint Arc, and it's a solid also. 
This one has on the back that it is 0.53 ounces. And this is a screw on lid. And you've got a little protected lid here. And it's a push out like deodorant. And this is very, smells really good. It smells of different berries, not like strawberry, like maybe a combination of berries, but it really smells good. It goes on kind of like you're putting on glue. It smells very good. I don't know how long it lasts. I haven't used it to, to know how long it's going to last or nothing like that. Uh, oops, gotta push it back down. But yeah, that's, that's a sweet smell. That's a nice one. It says that it's peony rose. How's it? Oh, it's different ones. Peony rose, but I got the very, very berry. Okay, and that was $5.39. So that was a little high compared to like this size and this size. This is a dollar something, this was five something. But it, it's worth it. It smells really, really, really good. Okay, the next one is a dupe of VSL. I'm not gonna remember trying to say what the words are because I don't even remember right now. My brain's just fried. And I have bought them in two different purchases because everybody loved it. So I figured I'd give one for a present and one for keep. And like I said, it is a YSL dupe. And they're $8.99. And I've already sprayed this. And this has the Go Flakes. And it smells really good. I'll show y'all. It has a really good smell to this. And it is the, the dupe for YSL, but it has YCL on the container. But on the box, it has YHJ. Oh, is the manufacturer's name, YHJ. But it's the Libra. Libri, the Libri, but it has the Go Flakes, and it smells really good, and it. it's $8.99. I can't wait. Now I could use all these because we've been, the ones of our favorites, we've been sneaking in and opening a box and spraying and then go. So now I can just get them all the boxes, and it can all be put up in uh, the ones we love in our own bathrooms, and the ones that we're eh, 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 about uh, we'll put in the guest bathroom for guests when they come over and they want if they want to try it out. Okay, so that's three. Next is, like I said, I'm not going to pronounce the names because there's no, and it is seven dollars and sixty four cents, and it is white tea orchid cologne. It says soft tea fragrance, just like quite airy, elegant, and self aware. And these are pretty good sized bottles. They're heavy glass. Uh, doesn't give a ounce on it. Let me see on here. I don't read Chinese, so I can't. Oh, there it is. 1.7 ounces. But if you want to know the... It's, it's, it's in Chinese. Mandarin, Chinese, one of the two. Uh, but this is white tea orchid. I'll spray them to let y'all, I know y'all can't smell them, but y'all be able to see the, the kind of spray they have. Pretty good. It's a good smell. I don't know what, white tea, but this is white tea vanilla is this the notes of it. So that was $7.64. Okay, let's see what our next one is. The next one is, I don't know if it's a dupe of YSL. But it has ASL on it. That's why I'm, I'm finding out like the ones that's kind of got the three letters like that is are dupes of the YSL. Um, but this is called Warm Kiss and it was $6.29. And oh, it's so cute. Look at the, the bottle, it's a pink tint to it. It's a beautiful container. How many ounces is this? Lord Jesus, they put it right where you can't see it. It is one fluid ounce. Ooh. So it's one fluid ounce. 
couldn't see it. And this is this doesn't have a strong. It has a short. It is a sweet smell. Um, a little. What's some of the perfumes you smell and you? I'm not going to say the word, but you smell cheap. I, I, I think to me it smells a little cheap, but that's to me. And this was six twenty nine, and it ha it has something floating in it. I don't know if y'all can see that. Okay, so let's go to the next one. La Vive de something Bella. This has vanilla notes to it. It says front tune is pear, middle tune is jasmine, post tune is vanilla. And this was eleven sixty nine, and it is three point four ounces. Eleven sixty nine, and this is a huge one. Comes with a little. So it has notes of pear, jasmine, and vanilla. And I'll spray it for y'all. That's got a good spray. Gotta spray it closer to me. I smell the pear and jasmine mixed together. It might be a vanilla with it, but you can smell it. Not one of my favorites, but it does smell good. We all, nobody likes, you know, it's the same. So what I think might not be like great, y'all might think it's the greatest thing ever. So it's cheap enough to, like I said, it was eleven sixty nine. It's three point something ounces. Um, I'd like to find a dupe of Beautiful by Estee Lauder. Uh, that would be cool. That'd be really good. Uh, let's see. Next is the Fasashi one. Uh, men's cologne and it's the Eros and it's 1.7 ounces and this was eight dollars and 49 cents and this is a spicy vanilla I'm glad my ceiling fans on to blow some of this and it has the Versace thing on the front and this is textured you can see it's raised out. And this is the Spice Vanilla. Ooh! Yep, it smells like a man. That smells good. This is this could be used for, like I wear the Sauvage. Well, not just want to smell my husband. Um so yeah, this smells good. This really does. You'd want your man smelling like this. And this was eight forty nine. It says a spice vanilla. Um, I don't know if it has a spice vanilla smell to it, but it smells good. It smells manly. Okay. So next is uh, Jean Miss, and this I'm, I'm gonna have to zoom in on to give you the notes. Because uh, if y'all have ever seen uh, Timu's perfumes, they have different uh, scents for the same name. Got my bangs going crazy here. Uh, Jean Mist could be like 10, 15 different, I want to say flavors, uh, scents. Uh, this one is the Jean, uh, Jean Mist Fireplace Glow. And it has top notes of orange flavor, male clove, and pink peppercorn. Middle tones or middle notes is juniper pine, Chinese chestnut and geisha wood. Base note is vanilla, balsam, and kashimini wood. And it is this color. Because if you notice, the Jean, the Jean Miss ones are different colors. And this is number. Uh, how's he going to tell me that it's all this on the thing? Hmm. I mean, it's right there. It says I bought the fireplace, fireplace flare. But then when you look at it on here, 
It's a little strange. It doesn't have any of those. So I don't know why. It says Fireplace Flare. Okay, on the bottle it says that it is tobacco leaf, spicy notes, that's the top tone. Middle note is vanilla, cocoa, and tonka bean. Their uh, base notes are dried fruits and woody notes. So maybe that's just a breakdown of the what they just said, but here it is. Oh wow. That really smells good. That smells, I don't, help, I don't smell the tobacco note, but I smell the vanilla. That smells really good. Really good. And it is the Far Place Glow G Miss. And it was $8.48. So I like that. It doesn't come for top. I think it's the only one that doesn't have a top. Um, okay, the next one is Miss Sweet. I have two of them. So I'm not for sure. I must have missed one of my purchases. They're both, uh, one's 1168 and one's 1169. And I don't have the 1168 because that's one of mine. My grandson has stole from me. So, and it says Otis. Uh, so I'm not sure which See, this is number two. No, it's number one. I bought number two. So, if you want to try this one out, you can try it out. I don't have the info on it. This is number two. And it says it is top notes of rose, middle notes of jasmine orange blossom, and the base notes is uh, vanilla. So, let's see what this is. And this is... Uh, Point five milliliters. They don't have ounces on this. Nope. Does it on here? Nope. Just oh, one point seven ounces. And the pink one is just like this, but pink. And they both have this kind of lid. It's like a. This is glass, but this is plastic. It's like a little bow. So, let me go back. Rose, Jasmine, and Vanilla. Oh, that smells good. Y'all know I'm going to smell good today, right? That really smells good. I smell the rose. Is it? Yeah, I smell Jasmine. I don't smell the Vanilla, but I smell the rose and the Jasmine. And that really smells good. I like this one. This one's going to my bathroom. Okay, so that was eleven sixty nine for 1.7 ounces. Okay, let's go down to here. What I did is I screenshotted uh, my count of the perfumes. Uh, that way I'd have it. And I have two of these, and they're both gone. So I don't know who has stole them. At least they left me the box, I guess. This is Jasmine. It was $4.97. Um, and it smells just like Jasmine, just like the first thing that you've seen of Jasmine. And this is what it looks like. My ring light get out of the way and it was 497 and it is 1.7 ounces also okay second is my dream boat and i have two of them someone done got that one too i'm telling you i've had it three months and half my stuff is missing somebody just really want couldn't wait uh so my dream boat is how many ounces are you 3.4 I don't know if it's a dupe of anything. I don't know if I could even get in it. Oh my goodness, I have no fingernails. None whatsoever. Of course, the one that's opened. I'm going to have to grab an ink pen. Hold on, y'all. I'll be right back. Oh my God, I'm too old. I feel like you've been on the floor and you can't get it back up. Let's see. Where's my cutter? I'm back down. Down when you get down, you can't get back up, huh? It's my knees. My knees. I've had a lot of injuries to my knees. Okay, get my little Timu blackout thing. Got the cutter on it. It retracts itself. 
So that's really cool. I think the ink's already dried up on it. I've had it for like a year. Oh, it's from VV Love. Look at, ouch. Like I said, it's 3.4 ounces. And they are $8.99. Yeah, they're both $8.99 each. And this is one of my favorites. Like I said, I bought one. And I said, oop, I better buy another one before something happens. And it is huge. And it's a heavy glass. It's a beautiful glass. I like the chrome on it. It's my dream boat. And I couldn't get the specs on what it was. Where you at? There you are. And it does smell so good. If you like a sweet perfume. Oh my goodness, that smells so good. I love it. It's it's sweet floral but fresh kind of my hair you're gonna have to pay not pay attention to me today i'm just like a mess today but my dream boat and it was 8.99 for 3.4 ounces so that's really good uh let me make sure i don't mess nothing okay we have savage by dior the elixir part the and so we got this one. If you ever go to, we got it at Ulta, Ulta, Ultra, Ulta, yeah, Ulta. Um, it was $145 for this bottle of Sauvage. About had a heart attack. Got it for my grandson. He didn't like it, but thank God my husband loved it. Um, but if you ever go, there's Sauvage. It has different scents. It's just not just one exact scent. It's Sauvage, and they have. Like, I think it's four different ones. Uh, this is not the exact one that I bought. It's one of the other ones. Uh, not really for sure. Um, this is the Wilderness one. And it's 3.4 ounces. And it was $11.69. And if you have a man in your life, go to Ulta. I don't know who else would sell it. That you could go smell it. And smell the Sauvage. And I'm telling you. It looks the same. The only thing different is... This you gotta, you gotta pull it off. Here, let me run and get my Sauvage and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm back. Hopefully it wasn't too long. Okay, this is the real thing. It was $145 for this bottle. Like I said, at Ulta. It is Christian Dior. You see the CD on the bottom. And this has a magnetic, I don't know if y'all know that, but it has a magnetic um, lid to it. See CD here, CD there, CD there for Christian Dior. Uh, and like I said, this was $145. And this is the dupe. You can also tell by the color of the bottles. Oops, let me. Come on, Carol Sue. Which one? I'm trying to look at my finder, and I should not do that. I have never, I'm starting to do that more often now than I ever did. They're the exact same looking type. You know, you can tell the difference. Um, but this is 145, and it's a commitment. So if you don't want the commitment, this smells like one of the other of the Sauvage flavors, scents. I'm always saying flavors. But it has the, it smells so good. It smells so good. It, like I said, if you have a, a, a young man wanting to start wearing clone and stuff, I would get this or I'd get it for my husband. I got it, I got it for a spare for my husband. Let me get this. Uh, I'm not ashamed to buy this. I have this. I don't want to do this again. Is this? I can't. I can't fathom paying that much for something. I really can't. It just blows my mind. But my grandson never asked for anything, so when he does ask for something, I'm gonna get it. It's, but yeah, Savage, 3.4 ounces. Is this the, the dupe? Uh, it's it's worth it. I recommend it highly. Okay, so that was one. Um, let me see. And on my list, I bought another one of these. 
the Libre. Uh, let's see what's next. How did I not do? Well, the next three, I don't have them on here. So I didn't check the orders. This is another dupe for YSL. It's the Black Opium. I have smelt that at Ulta. It smelled really good. This was $9.89, and it is a huge box. Uh, I'll have to find out the uh, comparison to this, because as soon as it came out, this one has YSL on it. Um, it was discontinued, and it is the op Black Opium. And if y'all know the designer of fragrances, you know by looking at this. That has a really good scent. Really good. Miss it. It is a sweet smell. There's something else here. Some. That's what I get out of this. This one right here, the, my, one of my favorites. Yeah, that's where I'm, I'm, I'm smelling it. But it's a texture bottle. And how many ounces did I say? 2.98, so three ounces. This is a heavy container. And it was $9.89. Black Opium. YSL. Oh, it says VSL. They so sneaky. Uh, so that's a good one. Uh, my grandson loved this one. I can't believe he didn't sell. I must have hit this one good. This was $16.19. Can open it? Oh. This is number 208 and it is Bling's and it is called Milk and Candy. And we seem to see the cupcakes on the front. So we thought it was going to be sweet smelling. If I could get it out. Oh. Well, if Carol C was smart. Lord Jesus. It slides out of the box. The box slides out. And I can't grip nothing. There's a lot of packaging still in there. See that? I think it was supposed to slide out, but that ain't sliding out. So I don't know what the deal is on that. And this is, I don't know if, can y'all see the colors? There's two different colors here. There's a blue on top, and the bottom is more like a pink color. See that? And let me see. Uh, why did I not take a picture of this? I know I just seen it. It's number 208, and it's called Milk and Candy. My fan's blowing it which way. This smells like, I don't get milk and candy, it smells like roses to me. Maybe you gotta mix it up. Can you mix it? Ooh, that's what it looks like mixed up. Let me try it now. That's a different smell. That smells good, it smells floral, it smells sweet. Don't, I don't know where they get milk and candy, but if you, when it's not mixed up, the pink smell on the bottom is a different smell than it mixed up together. So yeah, that I like that one. That one's really sweet. I love that. But it's not cupcakes. <laughs> so yeah, this one smells good. So I would try that. That was $16.19. And it is... I uh, don't have ounces. Don't have ounces on here. But it's a pretty good sized bottle. Okay, the last item. I did not have it either. And it is a perfume wardrobe. And it's by that same one that has some of the others. This is funny feeling. It's like it's supposed to open up the little band on it. And this was... 
$12.49 and it is a bunch of different ones. Uh, it's not telling you what the scents are on it. But they come so let me see. My smell spray boxes. Not a fan of that one. Oof. I smell like a French you know what. Woo! You ever guess in the eighties we used to say that? Guess it's not nice to say that, but let me see. This one, the pinkish red, the second one, it smells like a grapefruit. Um, my nose is going to be messed up today. This is like an orange color one. I don't know why they wouldn't tell us what it is. It's a nice light scent. I'm not really sure what. Uh, I don't know if I'm helping y'all, but spraying them or not. If I could even get them out of the container. Oh my goodness. This is a, you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight with it. That's a nice soft scent. Don't know what it is. But it's very light and very airy. Pop these out for I don't have to keep hurting myself. Here's a white one. And inside you can see it's, it's an orange color. Mm, I don't know about that one. That's a nice floral scent. This one. Now we're into the light blue and then a blue. It's a nice scent. It's light. I'm not. I can't describe it for you. But it's the only one that was not pleasant was the first one. Kind of the second one, but the first one for sure. Mm -mm. Mm, I don't know what that smells like, but mm -mm. so no to that one. So I have the first one. No, oh god, no. The last one, eh, maybe kind of. I don't know. I wouldn't wear it, but so ten out of twelve smells good to me. Uh, and it was twelve forty nine, so a little. A little over a dollar a piece. You can't beat that. Um, so yeah, so that's all 16. Uh, my favorites are Dreamboat, the Black Opium, the Sauvage, um, Go Flakes YSL, Jasmine. I have a rose, but it's I know my grandson's already sold it. Uh, what else was it? The Versace. Versace. Yeah, these are my favorite. Oh, and uh, this too. But yeah, I like the smell of vanilla, um, jasmine, some roses, as, does, as long as it doesn't smell like that really funky rose smell. Um, if you've ever smelled the old perfumes, uh, yeah. Uh, so yeah, that's my haul for today. I uh, hope everybody liked it today. Um, I wanted to try something different. So like I said, someone had asked to do a perfume uh, haul. And so it, like I said, it took me three months to get them saved up. 16, now like five purchases, one order, three, four, five, the next order. Uh, so now I finally got 16 of them. So I hope they helped you in some way of maybe giving y'all a little clue. Uh, and I do have the, the the dupe for the Brazilian Passion, the So Delay. 
so delay uh, the 62 I have two of those and it's uh, 26 or 60 y'all know which one it is uh, I have the dupes of that I have two of those uh, that is the only perfume that I've tried from Timu that doesn't last long. Now, whether the the real thing lasts long, I've heard it doesn't. Uh, so, I don't know. But to me, I have to put it on multiple times a day. But, like I said, we have gotten into these as we was waiting. And I know this lasts. And I'm telling you, this smells like the black op opium. So, those smell the same. Uh, you won't be disappointed with the Sauvage for men or the Versace for men. It smells really good. Um, did this one smell good? I don't remember. Yeah, this one smelled good. So now I got them all out. My uh, sink and my perfume little tray is going to be filled. Um, like I said, I'm going to put my favorites in my bathroom for no one can steal them. Um, and then the rest is going into spare bathroom or the guest bathroom. And when you come over and you want to smell good, you just spray some out. But I want to thank everybody for coming and checking out my channel. And I have more videos to come for Timu. And I have some DIY videos. And I want to thank you for subscribing and for coming back and checking me out and sticking with me. Um, I appreciate it so much. And if you like my content, uh, please check out other videos. Don't, don't judge me on one video. Because y'all know we all have days that we're off and stuff. And yeah, so... I want to thank everybody. See y'all later. Bye.